Hello chums, I'm Colonel Failure and you're watching Timberborn, or rather the beta for Timberborn, which opens on June the 18th. And you can sign up, I've stuck a link down below where you can get signed up for the old beta action there. And yes, it's a village builder, but not just any village builder. Let's, uh, let's get things rolling here. It's a village builder that involves beavers. Yes, oh lovely, lovely beavers. Just beavering around there. Right, we're going to see if we can't turn uh, uh, Beaver Town into something truly majestic. Right, first order of business, as is so often the case, is to, well, you know, massively deforest the area. Uh, so let's cut this lot down. There we go. Uh, should get some berries out of that as well, because we're going to need food fairly quickly. Um, otherwise, uh, people will get... You know, well, I say people, I mean beavers. Uh, we'll get uh, we'll get somewhat upset, or in fact starve, and uh, and we don't want that because they're beavers, um, and uh, and we want to care for the beavers. We we want a, a caring beaver society. So I've got the carrot field going on up there, and we'll also stick a little watering spot for people down there. Beavers, not people. Well, that's more or less the same. Beavers are people too. Are they though? I'll be quiet. Um, right, let's uh, let's grab a dirt path and run that up to the uh, up to the kind of storage shed hut yard. Now this is a this is actually quite an important building. This one, uh, this is the labour house, and you'll see that it comes with a, a radius around the outside of it, and that uh, that basically means that's the the sphere of influence under which it will help people do job people beavers um, do the job for the uh, for the local area right yeah i don't I've, I'm, I've only got a vague grasp on what that actually means in reality anyway we'll, we'll get pathing in uh we'll get this uh, uh get this carrot field done and that'll be a good place to start won't it yes it will all right look at this look look industrious beaver folk uh industriously beavering there. Oh, go on, you keep beavering. Now, all of these little patches here, these are sleeping mats. That's where they sleep at the moment. They want beaver houses. Yeah, which I'm pretty sure have a proper name, but uh, in this case, it's, it's called a lodge. <laughs> uh, yeah. Um, so, yeah, so we're going to, we'll build them a couple of lodges, but obviously these these all use a, an, an absolutely bundled load of, uh, of logs. Um, and therefore, this is probably not the best use of them to start with. Also, I'm not building enough houses for all of them. We're going to have a, a two-tier beaver society. Uh, those who live on sleeping mats and those who get a shed. Um, terrific. Ah, it's going to be it's going to be absolutely brilliant. Um, so there we go. Right. Good. I need a I need a log pile in which to store logs for later usage. Yes. There we go. Um, and uh, and that's going to be that's going to be on my on my next couple of things to do, uh, but you'll see we've got uh, two beavers beavering away in the field. We've got uh, Yovnoko here and uh, Rudum, good classic beaver names going on there, and uh, yeah, that's good. We'll get sixty five odd carrots after four days. Ah, uh, there's some proper quick carrot growth happening there, and no mistake. Um, yeah, good. Uh, we've got a total population of 11, seven of which are adults, four of which are children. And uh, the children grow up fairly quickly, which is probably just as well, because uh, keeping, uh, keeping everybody working is going to become more tricky over time as I, uh, as I ramp up the amount of work I ask them to do. Can we slot that in? Yes, we can. Movie sleeping mats. There we are. Yeah. No, that's where we're going. So we're going to keep the logs. All right, I'm going to up the tempo. They are seven times. Yeah, one times, three times, and seven times, which are very traditional in terms of uh, of speed multipliers. Oh, night time. Okay, good. Are we? Uh, how long are we working? You can set how long, how many hours in the day they work for. And at the moment, we've gone for 16, which is the default. That's fine. Uh, now we've got uh, an average well-being of three at the moment. Uh, if I can get it up to, I think it's seven, maybe eight, uh, then we unlock another kind of beaver. Uh, one that is uh, is slightly harder working, but slightly hungrier. And apparently that generates more of a challenge. I can, I can totally understand that. They'll all go down to the watering hole when they need some water, which is probably good. There we go. Look, day two. Uh, Wardwag has grown up. Good for you, Wardwag. That's... Uh, 
Well done, you've graduated. You're, so you're thirsty. You uh, you want to go get a drink, mate? You want to go get a drink? Go on. Don't don't wait for an invitation. If you're thirsty, go have something to drink. It's important. Right. We've clearly not got enough materials going on here, so I'm going to I'm going to issue another uh, deforestation manoeuvre. How about all of these? There you go. Go chop them down. And, and then we'll be able to build more stuff. Because I want to get on to research. Because once you start re researching things, progress. Progress starts occurring. Uh, and then beyond that, of course, we can, uh, we can build some electricity and get some electrical things occurring as well. So, yeah, it's all very technical. And you're thirsty in the middle of the night. Go get a drink. Don't go straight for chopping down a tree. If you're thirsty, get a drink. Look, I I run a very clean beaver society. I have I have no need for you to uh, to be parched uh, while while doing your good works for the day. We've got a lodge being built, lovely. And into here we've got uh, Macaulay and uh, Yukazon, uh, Yukazcon, I should say, and uh, Rakash. <clears throat> Splendid. Now, if I build enough of these lodges, we should be able to get some uh, uh, some additional. Uh, beaver action going on as uh, as the beavers procreate with one another. Uh, well, I mean, I don't know what else they procreate with, to be honest, but, uh, you know, perhaps that's not something for speculation. Uh, right, let's put the science shed down there. I'm pretty sure I've got the, uh, the necessary uh, resources to get that built, and then we'll build a path out to it. Good. Right. Excellent. Now, the way science works is you put a, you put a science beaver in there, so, you know, one with qualifications and a burning thirst for knowledge. Um, and, uh, and in there, uh, they will earn you research points, which you can then use to, to unlock stuff. So there's no set order at which stuff unlocks. As you can see, the, the wooden stairs, 70 points. Uh, the footbridge, 120. Scaffolding is 90. All right, fine. Um, yeah, no, that's good. I approve of that. Uh, let's put a, a little ca let's put a campfire in so uh, they can tell each other beavery tales of an evening uh, if, they, uh, if they feel like it. Oh, look at that. Having a, having a local log supply has, uh, has become a boon on that front. Uh, berries is the only food stuff we've got left, and we're down to 20-something. We're now happiness level four. Come on, beaver goals. Um, right, more housing. Let's get that going next. Now, playing this at warp speed, you perhaps lose some of the uh, beavery goodness of, uh, you know, it, it looking delightful. Do I want to evict this dude at night? Seems a bit harsh. It does seem a bit harsh. Um, no, let's uh, let's let's give him let's give him the rest of the night. Actually, it's, it's morning again. I've I've rather uh, I've rather overshot that that line of inquiry. Um, okay, no, that's fine. Another three lodges in there. That'll get everyone happy, and maybe we'll get some uh, some new beavers being generated as uh, as they conduct themselves in the way that beavers so frequently do. Let's get a cut down going on here because we're running a bit low on food. Now it doesn't completely depopulate the area, so we're not uh, we're not clear cutting here. They'll uh, they'll take what is available to be harvested, and uh, and it will regrow. Now you've got re you've got clear cut options in there, uh, which lives. There you go. Cut them all down, just destroy. But that's no. We're we're at one with nature, because uh, that's how nature wants it. Uh, right. Slap that through there. Yeah. I mean, that's, that's largely a, a redundant bit of uh, pathway there, I'll be honest. But uh, it's, all, uh, it's all in the name of pro. Everyone's hungry. Oh, no. Well, get the berries then, team. Team, berries, berries. Get the team. We've got carrots have just been harvested. All right, okay, we live. And we're happier than ever. Fantastic. Right, they've got two trees they can't reach. Yeah, there's one up there. Yeah, that's okay. And three beavers currently don't have a job. Go, go and cut some stuff down then, lads. Go on, we've got all of this needs doing. The food's been fixed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, and, uh, oh, look. Uh, ankle, gra ankle Gads has grown up, and so has Rakesh. Ah, delightful. Uh, I suppose I ought to... I mean, I've, I've, you've got to get the housing sorted early on uh, so that, uh, you know, so that you can maintain the level of happiness that you're, you're, you're trying to achieve. Uh, and it's, it's somewhat critical. There you go. No, look, there you go. See, look, we've been going 10 minutes and, uh, and this is coming along. We've almost got everybody housed. In fact, 
I don't think I'm seeing that many sleeping mats. One. One, one lucky beaver gets to sleep al fresco. That's... I mean, I'm sure they're enjoying that. Of a sort. Assuming the weather's nice, of course. Uh, right, let's uh, let's get some more trees so that we can continue the building projects. Yeah, go on. Go grab that lot. Yep, hack them all down. Now, one of the things you can research is a forester, in which case you will get a beaver just, you know, merrily replanting trees all over the joint, uh, which is which is good. Uh, and that's that helps. That helps quite a bit. Right, we've got no children. We can support up to seven. Interesting. And I've got seven houses. One child per house. Uh, two adults per house. Yes. Very good. Okay, I I see how that works. Right, we ought to get another uh, another carrot run uh, on the on the spin here. Now the uh, the upgrade from carrots. What is it, is it an upgrade? Well, look, call it an upgrade, and then we'll we'll work it out from there. Um, the upgrade, happiness level six. Oh yeah, who's the beaver master? That would be me. Uh, we're going to have to perma remove some of these plants to get another field in there. Let's slow it back down again for a moment while I while I ponder my next thrilling move. Um, right, trees, yeah. Uh, right, scrag this lot, please. I want them out of here. It's, uh, important carrot business has to be uh, has to be deployed in that area. Cuts down all trees and plants. Pretty sure that's what I just did, but let's do it again just to be on the safe side. Pretty sure that's just what I did. Did did just now. What's what? What did you? I did. Right. So elsewhere in the menu, you've got monuments. All right. So we could have a. It's it it makes people awestruck. Uses 200 logs. I mean, that's a, that's a lot of logs. I've got 30 in stock, which isn't too bad. Uh, decorations, we can put, you know, shrubs and, you know, all of that kind of merriment. Uh, additional, we could we build a temple. Steady. Um, yeah, or printing press for uh, for your bookish, uh, your bookish beaver. Right, okay. Um, yeah, woodworking. We've, we need to build a carpenter at some point. Fairly soon, actually. Um, in order to make planks from logs, I know there's a there's a novel thing, uh, making planks out of logs. That's that's something that doesn't happen very often. There you go, second carrot field, all important. I don't know. No, we've, we've we've got to keep the food supply up. We can't rely on uh, on just foraging for berries uh, to be a, a prosperous beaver-based society. We've we've got to do a little bit more than that. Uh, then housing, we've only got one choice right now. Uh, in labour, we've got a labour house, which is what we've got here. Uh, you've got the labour flag, which drags people to the area to do work, and then you've got the hauling post. All right, anything within range of the hauling post gets a gets a strength bonus, which means that stuff generally gets done quite a bit faster. All right, okay, yeah, so it's like a, a buff building. It's exactly like a buff building. Uh, water tank, large warehouse, small warehouse. We're not bothered about any of that right now. We're store. Hold on, wait. Hold on. Hold on. All right, that's full. All right, we are bothered about that. Well, we better we better get a get a small warehouse. Oh, look, this this looks like a, a good place for a small warehouse. How many science? Sixty science points. Not really enough. All right, small warehouse in here, and then I'll leave the rest of the room, and we'll put shrubs and decorations and all of that kind of fandango in there in a minute. All right, bang that in there. I think I missed a bit of path. Will that? Uh, yeah, get a bit of path in there. Let's get a spare bit of house. Um, if we can encourage uh, some uh, some beaver on beaver action uh, to uh, to get a population up, then uh, then that'll be good too. It's natural. It's fine. It's, there's you know there's nothing weird about that in the slightest. That's uh, that's all totally natural. Right, and then we'll get we'll get power going. Now I've only dabbled with power. I've got a pretty good idea how it works, but uh, I've only dabbled with it. So I've only got a, a pretty good idea how it works. We're going to stick our first water wheel out here, uh, and then we'll route that into a uh, into a sawmill over here somewhere, and that should that should be good. I <laughs> don't know. Um, yeah, good. Right, we've got one beaver who's unemployed. Where are they? Get do some work, will you? Have I not got any chopping orders on the go at the moment? I mean, we've got these bushes still need tending to. We've got some trees need cutting down. Go and get on with it. This is uh, Azajoth, who's 10, currently jobless. Well, you'll be all right. Hungry, not too much. Thirsty, yeah. It's got no fun. 
no fun. If you if I were to get the fun up, it'd work faster. All right, okay. Not very comfortable. Well, moderately comfortable. Look, your life expectancy is plus twenty five percent. Or is that what you get when the bars fall? Yeah, valid, valid. Anyway, don't know. But uh, yes, uh, yeah, it's, it's going to be fine. Someone's a bit thirsty. Who's that? Oh, my Lord, That's uh, uh, Jovnico. Yeah. All right. Uh, Jov, get yourself a drink there, my friend. Uh, it's uh, it's all uh, it's all trotting on. We've got an, we've got a spare house now. We can now support up to twenty four beavers in our population. But uh, for some reason, I, I mean, I, I suspect they might all be just a little bit weary come the end of the working day because they are lovely, lovely beavers. And, uh, and that's nice too. Right, so to unlock the temple, we need 300 points. I, I, I've only got 66 when I went near that. 400 gets the printing press, and 700 gets a carousel. Now, could just be me, but I think having beavers on a carousel is, is something that everybody deserves to see at least once in their life. Um, so maybe, maybe that's something I should set as a priority. Not right now. Okay, up the tempo again. It's night time. Not a lot happens at night time. So, uh, so far as I know, uh, we're still waiting the arrival of our, our first new beaver young friend uh, born into this colony of beavery goodness. Um, but uh, but as yet, it hasn't happened. Right. Someone want to build this water wheel? There we go. No, that's it. Logs are starting to turn up. All right. Good stuff. Right. And then while we're... Uh, how is the log situation? Grim. Okay. Right. Well... Go logging, team. Uh, go get logged. Do the log thing. That's it. Go on, get all of that lot. These these will be back. They're, it's fine. As you can see, the original batch that we uh, that we stripped down there, they're all starting to regrow. So it's all it's all good. Don't if you're thirsty, get a drink. I shouldn't have to tell you. That should be a natural imperative that you have going on there of, of to just go and get a go get yourself a liquid beverage as opposed to a solid beverage. Quiet. Um, when uh, when the thirst struck... We've... No, no, sorry. Read the wrong, wrong thing. Ah, uh, no. Thought for a moment we'd had a child, but no, it's just an inventor. Um, oh, we have had... We've had a child. Uh, a Cryjo was born. Well done, a Cryjo. You live in a lodge. Which lodge do you live in? Which lodge do you live in? Um, uh, there we go. Uh, Macaulay and uh, Uka's Con have, uh, have, have found themselves in a position to, uh, to, to make a new beaver. Super. And uh, we're going to need we're going to need more where that came from. I mean, I've got lots of I've got lots of spare space for beavers at the moment. In fact, I mean, you've got Halasua here who is deeply unpopular. No one wants to live with them. Um, I'm sure that'll change. I'm sure, you know, someone will kind of go, you're the beaver for me. And uh, they are. I've no idea gender-wise. I've done it. Beavers presumably have genders. I believe they're mammals. So, uh, but no idea. Halasua there is uh, is just a beaver. Regular beaver like any other beaver. Likes beavery things. Beavers for all they're worth. I've, I, I'll be We've got three children now, clearly... There was the, it was the carrots. Carrots got them going. All right, fair play. I mean, water wheels rocking, smashing. Right now, onto the next, uh, onto the next engagement here. Now we'll go to woodworking. We'll get a carpenter up. Uh, where do we want to get the carpenter up? We'll get a carpenter up here. Right now, the carpenter's going to need some power. Uh, and to do that, we uh, we place uh, these mechanical shafts onto. Uh, Onto the onto the uh, the connecting point there, but the good news is the connecting point can be just about anywhere. Um, I just want to put a junction in there. That's it. Right, that should do the trick. And then I can run me I can run me power off in multi directions. You see, uh, once that's done, I don't even really need planks. I'll be honest with you, but you know we'll get them built. It's uh, it would seem to be a you know sensible thing to do is to have this stuff. Although, I quite fancy building a bridge over to the other side of the river. Why? Because it's there. That's, that's, why, that's why all of the great things in life have, uh, have ever been done. So we've had uh, Katanja has been born and Angie. Sweet. Good. Good pathing there, team. Good path work. Yeah. Oi, Porkins, don't just sit in the front door of the shed. Get yourself out of the way or get yourself to work. 
Just, who is this? This is uh, Kuski, who's 31. What's your job? You appear to be just parked up. You lazy beaver. Um, right. Uh, yeah, well, I mean, it's okay. We're, we've got no nothing that is particularly pressing. But, you know, it's, it's always good to see industrious beavers rather than the ones just kind of knocking around the joint going, ah, it's all right. I'm going to hang out for the day. I'm a beaver. Right, here. I'll, yeah, grab that lot. And then our, our log pile will overfloweth with loggy goodness. And, uh, and that'll be good. We've still got a heck of a lot of berries that we're relying on. I, I get a bit nervous when I see that we're out of carrots. Because uh, it basically means that we're we're relying on the foragers to uh, to keep us well fed and nourished, and uh, yeah, there you, there there you go. Right, okay, let's see about getting across this river, shall we? Uh, what have we got? Footbridge needs planks. Well, as luck would have it, I'm building planks now. There we go. We are we are now in a uh, in a position to start kicking out. You need uh, you need logs. Yeah, good. You kick out planks. Sweet. And we've our first plank has been made. It is a it is a, a banner moment for the colony there. Good. Now the only thing that that I'm currently a bit short on, and I've got, it's a bit of a loss to know how to do, is uh, how does how does one automate the uh, the collection of logs? I shouldn't be I shouldn't need to uh, to be telling the team to uh, to grab logs. Maybe it's a job post. Is it a job post, do we think? Labour, yeah. Employees do labour jobs around this building. Yeah, but I have to set that job in the first place. And if I constantly have to tell them to uh, to chop down logs, well, that's, that's micromanagement, which is the bane of things. All right, if I have to micromanage, then, then fair play. Right, we've got a forester, 60 points. We'll get with the forester. I've got 138 now. Yeah, the gear workshop will allow me to make gears. Don't need them. I barely need planks. Uh, <clears throat> the paper mill would be good. That will allow us to build the uh, uh, whatever uh, whatever we choose to call it. The Beaver Express. Uh, the Beaver Town Chronicle. Well, there's, a, there's a number of different names to conjure with. Uh, let's go for... Am I going to need stairs to get on the footbridge? I better flip in not. Uh, scaffolding, yeah. It's 120 points for... All right, I'm going to go for the footbridge. Yep, gimme. Because I want to see if I can get across the water. All right, let's do that. There we are. And then hopefully we can get across the other side, in which case we'll go and, uh, we'll go and rapid harvest these uh, these trees over here I'm, I'm also interested to see what happens when we get outside the sphere of influence of the uh, uh, of the the get to work shed which is what it's called obviously uh, right unable, unable to reach construction site but you will do don't worry once we've built the first yeah they don't need steps excellent steps get you up the up the ledges I imagine in fact I don't even need to imagine it that's definitely what they do right good hooray for beavers uh, right, grab this. Yeah, issue the destruction order on that lot. We've got quite a few there. Can't be reached because there aren't any steps. Roger that. Okay, that's fine. 196 food in stock. Okay. Yeah, maybe another science shed. I don't know. Is there an upgrade or something like that in there? There doesn't seem to be. Now, obviously, this is the beta, so there may yet be stuff to come. Uh, but at the moment, it does look like everything is more or less you know hunky dory uh there's plenty to do it it all works rather well it's uh it's simply a case of uh you know just just ride it out and see oh look yeah it's all yeah see we can uh, we can get a better feel for the landscape here yeah i mean terraforming this as a as a new beaver society we've now got 14 adult beavers we've got two kids terrific there you go you're in there two six-year-olds Childhood sweethearts kicking around in there, and uh, uh, Halazuria has managed to find a buddy. That's nice too. Is, does that mean we're no? We've got a spare house there, and that one's spare as well. All right, still got spare housing. I'm flipping all over this, you know. I've got this is this is well and truly under control. Right, okay, go on, then. Give me the shrub. All right, team, start shrub. Twelve logs, flipping heck. For a shrub, 
I mean, honestly, that's that's a lot of money for, for something that only looks about as good as the berry trees do. I mean, I guess there's a benefit to it because, you know, it will be beaver built and, uh, and therefore it will conform to all of the beavery aesthetics that people like. All right, I think we need to diversify the diet a little bit. I mean, I don't think it's necessary, necessary, necessary. Uh, but uh, let's go, uh, let's go after the potatoes. Although, what else we got? We got wheat mm, and a grist mill, okay, uh, and a bakery. All right, sweet as nuts, and a water pump. Well, I think they're doing absolutely dandy, just going down to the uh, river to uh, to do that. Oh, we are level seven beavers now. <laughs> Yes, we are. Right, potatoes. Um, now, do I really want to plough under this, which has proved to be quite a valuable food source since we got started? Hold on, maybe we can... Uh, yes, look at that. It fits in there like it was always meant to be. Uh, just stick it there. All right. What? What's the problem? You were happy enough building there a moment ago. What occurred? What uh, What transpired? Why am I now not? Has that, has that tree just got in my face? Because uh, I don't, I will, well, we'll show it who's boss. There you go. Get rid of that. Uh, and then, yeah, because potatoes, they're flipping critical to the evolution of a society. As you know, um, no potatoes, no society. That's, uh, that's the thing. That's the, I mean, that's, you know, it's, it's one of uh, America's greatest contributions, the, the landmass America. Uh, to the uh, to the planet as a whole is the uh, is the noble potato, um, right? I'm going to unlock the wooden stairs and then we can get upstairs. Yes, please. Right, uh, yeah, you go and sit. Uh, no, I won't stick you there. Right, we've got a staircase here already, but uh, but having one that is beaver built, beaver owned, for beavers by beavers, all of that kind of business. Um, you know, I think that does us a, does us a lot of good. It's gonna it's gonna reinforce morale significantly. Yeah, you'll see. Look, we're down to thirty four berries. Now these potatoes on their own, they're not gonna do me any good. No, I've got to do stuff to potatoes in order to make them viable. Um, right, uh, you need a grill, grilled potatoes. That's that's pretty good. Sounds sounds pretty respectable if you ask me. Um, right, yeah, okay. Just stick the, uh, this is the grill house, incidentally. Yeah, bang it in there. Try and keep all your critical buildings centralised, you see, and that way uh, people can get to them and do stuff, which is important. Uh, right, now, can I, yeah, we can rotate. Oh, no, that's just going to throw me off my game. I'm going to bang some stairs in here so they can get to these unreachables. Uh, yep, go on. Uh, right, okay. Slap this one in there and that one in there. Yes, there we go. Yeah, and then uh, I'll tell you what else. We'll bang a we'll bang a path in there, and then we've got the uh, the Beaver Super Highway going on. The Highway of Desire, if what you desire, of course, is trees uh, or climbing stairs, uh, for that matter. Right, more houses. Well, uh, this is a Beaver Society par excellence. Um, right, yeah, you can. Yeah, someone can live there. I was going to I was going to try and turn this into some kind of housing estate back here. I, I, th I think I probably still will. In fact, you can just live right behind the uh, the primary business shed. It would it might make for a nice perk that the uh, the business shed owner operator Porkins here sat know. outside the front door. No, someone else is there now. Okay, this this is Kellyn. Okay, all right, all right, Kellyn, how's it shaking? I'm, I'm building you your own personal business shed uh, accommodation. It's part of the, uh, ooh, you know, part of the, the general uh, perks of being the uh, the, 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 the beaver in chief. The, the labor union beaver. Right, I ain't got enough planks. No, I haven't got enough logs in order to make these staircases. Right, fine. It's okay, I'll get to it. Uh, yeah, go on, go after this lot. Go on, hack them all down. Yeah, we care not for the uh, the nobility of treehood. Every, why are you all so thirsty? Go and get yourselves a drink. Don't make me spend money on a well. I've got a finite amount of sciencey points right now, and I want to spend that on cool things. You're hungry. 
Well, that's possibly because we're not really harvesting enough food. I oh, see that which I had been nervous about. The, uh, the lack of food is starting to become a grim reality. So every four days we get 65 carrots from here. Every four days we get 65 carrots from here. Okay, that's good. Then, and then, how fast do these grow? We get, get 30 potatoes every uh, every six days. All right, okay. And then, uh, and then, whenever the bushes decide to uh, to proffer forth their their fruity majesty, uh, we get that as well. well. Go go get the fruity majesty that has been proffered. We could use it. Uh, right, yeah, 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 yeah. Get all of that. Oh no, 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 no. What was that? What was that? Um, flipping Halasua has died of thirst. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, that's oh that's oh that's properly upsetting. You see, when it's little village people, it means nothing to me. But I just killed a beaver. Oh flipping heck, I better make amends somehow. What about some sort of UK beaver charity kind of deal? The Beaver Trust, yes, that'll do nicely. Happy to support you. A hundred quid though, not unless I'm getting my own beaver out of it, you'll have twenty-five quid and you'll like it. There you go, right, that makes amends. Now, somehow I've got to train these idiots to go and have a drink when they need it. Well, I guess I'm just going to have to build a well then. Clearly, getting down to the river's too much work for these beavery people. Um, and, uh, um, you're thirsty, go and get a drink. It's in... Thirsty, get a drink. You, clown, get a drink. Get a drink. We'll soon die of thirst. Don't die of thirst, get a drink. Don't... Get a drink. I can't give you direct instructions. Oh no, don't die of <gasps> thirst. Oh, just, would you flip in just go and buy, go and get a drink. Please go and get a drink. Please get a drink. Just please get a drink. Just get, oi, get a drink, clown. Kuskui, 42 years old, hasn't figured out how to get a drink when he's there. There we go, that's it, yeah, yeah. Top yourself up, flipping heck. Just, I mean, have some sense of self-preservation there, my beavery friends. Uh, otherwise, you know, there'll be ramifications. Well, there you go. That's, I mean, you know, that's the first look. That's what you want. Uh, as mentioned, the beta is about to kick off, and I believe they're letting all and sundry just get in there to, uh, to beaver it up one time, give a bit of feedback. These steps, yeah, useless. They are, aren't they? Yep. You've you've made something completely worthless there. I have. Ah, okay. All right. Well, I need. To, you, you're going to need more steps. Build some more steps then. Uh, you might need a, sca a scaffold. Right. Okay. Yeah. In fact, so we could replace that bridge with one that actually gets them straight up to the uh, to the action level. All right. Well, go for it then. All right. So if we stick one there, yeah, and we stick one there, and we stick one here. Yeah. That's all right. It's all good. Yeah. It's all good. Everything's good here. Right? And then once they're built, you stick a set of steps there and a set of steps there and we'll be we'll be groovy. All right. Smashing. Good. Uh yeah. Okay. Look, let's uh, let's leave us with some action beaver shot. Everyone's thirsty. I no, I could not bear I'm going to stop playing cuz I could not bear another dead beaver on my conscience. No dead beavers on my watch, says beaver caring individual. I don't, know. I don't know what it is about beavers. They're just, you know, we like them. Beavers, good darts, basically. Um, yeah, food and water. All right, find a flipping water pump then. We need logs, planks. Got both of those. Yeah, get it. Right. Put it somewhere where it is inescapable, uh, where people will be impelled towards uh, just find somewhere to flip in do it that way doesn't want to go it doesn't does it oh i see okay hold on no, all right hang on uh, you, you just, do you need a water source at one end yes you do well in which case how is this any better than uh, than just heading down to the riverbank and supping on uh, on nature's bounteous coursing trickle what are you talking about? 
all right i've been colonel failure thank you very much for watching and uh yeah that's that's your lot no, that's that'll do it's a quick look at beaver town this which isn't called T beaver town it's called timberborn beaver town's a bad name everyone's very thirsty cheerio killed a beaver felt wretched about it decided to go and support some beaver charity it's just the way that uh just the way that life goes there i suppose anyway uh in the description but down there somewhere possibly in the comments depends where i put it uh is the link whereby you can sign up to go and join in the beta uh which kicks off on the 18th of june and therefore what else are you going to do it's cute um it's a perfectly competent little village builder it maybe needs uh just one or two more angles from what i've played a bit so far i've stuck a couple stuck a couple of hours into it um but uh yeah one or two more angles and i think it could have something quite special going on uh beaver based religion for example maybe a beaver uprising all these things and, and frankly just the inclusion of beavers in the first place is splendid way to uh, splendid way to proceed anyway there you go that's it We're, uh, i'm done here in beaver town for now there is no ruling out that i might revisit in the future but uh, you've seen all you need to today haven't you